Welcome to the FSM Prep Rally. My name is Griffin Kemp. I'm standing here for Joe and Big Ant. Unfortunately, they couldn't be here tonight, but they missed a hell of a game. We are out here at Green Valley High School where the Gators just defeated the Sierra Vista Mountain Lions 40 to 39 in a third overtime thriller of a game. We will have the player of the game as well as the head coach of the Green Valley Gators joining us. But for now, I believe under three minutes left, took a tickets team 80 yards. Uh, Scoop was his big play receiver. And man, these guys laid it all out on the line. And you got to be happy for what Devin Jones did, which atoned for the loss they had in week two. It did. It did. I mean, it's hard when you face a team in the regular season and then you see them again in the playoffs. It's like they said, it's hard to beat a team twice. And they know it's you've seen each other. You know how the other plays. So the fact that they came out here, they were down a ton. They, they faced a bunch of adversity in this game. Hell of a performance. Silverado by taking on Coronado. Griff, what were your thoughts of the game? Silverado just keeps looking dominant every single game they play. It doesn't matter if it's against a 5A level school or against another undefeated 4A school. These guys come in, they show out, and they are one of my personal favorites to watch this season. Place. Right, and speaking about your quarterback, uh, Jack Thau, he, it seemed at, throughout the entire game, he was making plays, whether it was throwing with his arm or getting the first downs, running with his feet, yeah. just doing whatever it took to keep your offense on the field and mm -hmm. pushing down. Uh, talk about him and what he's kind of been as a senior captain for your team. Yeah, Coach, so he's it's like you said, uh, you're not here to compliment your players. You're here to make them better. You guys sitting now 4-0 in the season. I mean, the success has gone back since last season. I mean, you guys have had such a crazy run. What do you say to your players to keep them hungry and to realize that the goal is not accomplished for this season? Um, again, I, I got to put that one back on our on our senior you, class. You, you can't write you can't write a better story. This team's been looking for that storybook ending, and man, chapter one's just been written. Hey, it's a hell of a chapter to be written. You guys came out here and you had an all-out battle with this team that you guys actually faced in the last game of the yep. regular season. So tell me, with such a tight game. What does it mean to you to get that first home playoff win here at Green Valley, here on your guys' home field, and to be able to make the plays that you did for your team? Oh, man. First time in eight years. I ask you, man. Opening kickoff, return for a touchdown. Next touchdown, y'all scores. You running it into the end zone. You get a pick on defense. I just got to ask you, man, you're, you're a jack of all trades. What, what, which, uh, which phase of the game do you think you get the most joy out of? Or what do you just, what, what seems to be more fun? Um, I don't know. 